Hi, I'm Chris Stoich with JVC, and we're here at Cedia 2022 in Dallas, and I'd like to show you the JVC lineup of DILA projectors. DILA is our flagship technology. JVC is known for the best black level and the best native contrast in the industry, and of course that contributes to the best picture. These DILA imaging chips are native 4K, and they also have excellent color reproduction. Right now we're looking at the DLA NP5, also known as the DLA RS1100. This is our 699995 retail projector. This is 1900 lumens in a lamp-based design. Uh, this has our Frame Adapt HDR, which is our unique dynamic tone mapping solution. With 4K HDR video, we are able to measure that video either scene by scene or frame by frame. I happen to like frame by frame. And we adjust all the picture parameters automatically. And this happens in the background so the customer does not have to worry about this at all. We also have an automatic picture mode select. So no matter what content you're watching, the JVC projector is able to automatically pick the correct picture mode. This is also a very full featured projector with a fully motorized lens. So motorized focus, zoom and shift. And that allows us 10 installation modes. And that makes this projector an excellent choice for widescreen applications where you have uh, say a 2.35 or 2.40 to one screen. And you can set up the different installation modes to accommodate that. So beyond that, I want to talk about the fact that this is 48 gigabit per second HDMI. This is the newest, latest, greatest HDMI standard. Uh, this projector supports 4K resolution at up to 120 frames per second. That makes it perfect for gaming applications uh, and also for all the latest video content. Uh, this is a three-year parts and labor warranty with first-year advance exchange, so excellent support from JVC. If you would like these kind of features, but you also would like a laser, then we're going to go over here. This is the DLA NZ7, also known as the DLA RS2100, and this is a $10,999.95 retail. And uh, this is a 2200 lumen laser light engine. All of the same things we've previously talked about, but in addition to the 4K at 120 frames per second input, this has an 8K at 60 frames per second input. And this has a feature we call 8K E-Shift. This is our original 8K E-Shift and it flashes the screen twice for every frame of video. So you're able to get over 17 million pixels on the screen for an impressive 8K picture. The next step up, we go to the DLA NZ8, also known as the DLA RS3100. This projector is 2,500 lumens, again, laser, and this has a variety of nice upgrades. This has a cinema filter for expanded color gamut, so a little bit better color. This has our high contrast optical block for better in-frame contrast, and this has a dual aperture for better on-off contrast. This also has something called E-Shift X. If you remember, I explained the uh, model below it flashes the screen twice for each frame of 8K video. This projector flashes the screen four times for each frame of 8K video, so there's a total of 35 million pixels on the screen. True 8K resolution with the JVC DILA projector here. And then we go to our top of the line model, which is the DLA NZ9, also known as the DLA RS4100. And here you can immediately see the larger lens. That's part of the reason this projector is rated at 3000 lumens, because bigger lens, uh, bigger opening, more light from inside makes it to the screen. This is also our sharpest, highest resolution lens and this lens has our most accurate mechanism. If you remember earlier, I talked about how JVC works very well with widescreen uh, projection systems. This lens has four times the accuracy hitting that spot exactly. These lenses are very good, but this is four times better. 
This also has a little wider shift range for even greater installation flexibility. And this has a slightly different throw ratio. So just a little bit larger image at any given uh, throw distance. So that's our top of the line model at a $25,999.95 retail price. Uh, the other thing we want to talk about is for all of these DILA models, JVC has announced a firmware update. So even if you already own one of these, we're about to make it better. Um, and what we're doing, so we're adding, uh, and this will be coming in mid-November, we're adding uh, filmmaker mode, which allows you to have a simple preset to see the video exactly as the filmmaker intended. It defeats certain processing and it locks in other specific settings uh, to show the filmmaker's intent. Uh, in addition to that, uh, we've had some requests for even brighter HDR content, so we've improved our frame adapt HDR. Now, if you like the way it currently works, it won't change. Uh, the original two modes are still in there. Uh, or excuse me, the original one mode is still in there, but there is now a second mode. Uh, in addition to automatic, we have auto wide, and auto wide is designed to give you a brighter image if you like that. Uh, we also have additional presets for frame adapt HDR, so you can use it with. Uh, let, maybe you want a preset for darkroom viewing for movies. Maybe you want a different preset for brighter viewing for maybe sports. You can do that. We also have improved dynamic dimming. Uh, again, the original two modes are still there, but there's now a third mode. The original modes looked at the average brightness of the picture. The new mode looks at the peak brightness of the picture when setting the proper dynamic dimming, and it also allows full fade to black for infinite contrast. The improved dimming is, of course, on the laser models only. Uh, in addition, there's a variety of other smaller improvements, and we're very happy to see this. And again, this will be coming out in November. And for more information, you can check out www.jvc.com. And thanks for checking this out.